Wi-Fi allows devices like mobile phones, laptops, and smart TVs to send and receive information without any cables using invisible radio waves. A basic Wi-Fi setup involves two main players, the wireless device, called a client, and the wireless router, called an access point. Every Wi-Fi device has a small radio transmitter and receiver inside it. When you open a website or play a video, your device first converts that request into digital data made of ones and zeros. This digital data cannot travel through air by itself, so your device's Wi-Fi radio transmitter converts it into a radio signal. This radio signal is sent into the air on a specific frequency, usually 2.4 GHz or 5 GHz. These frequencies are like agreed-upon radio stations that both your device and the router are tuned to. Your Wi-Fi router acts like a middleman. It is always listening for signals from your devices. When the router receives a radio signal, it converts it back into digital data. Then it sends this data through a physical cable to the Internet, where it reaches distant computers called servers. The server sends the requested information back the same way. The data travels through cables to your router. The router converts it into radio waves again and broadcasts them into the air. Your device receives these signals, decodes them back into digital data, and finally shows you the web page, video, or message on your screen. This sending and receiving happens millions of times every second, which is why Wi-Fi feels instant. Wi-Fi uses different frequency bands. The 2.4 GHz band travels farther and passes through walls better, but it is slower and more crowded. The 5 GHz band is faster and less crowded, but it cannot pass through walls easily and has a shorter range. Things like walls, microwave ovens, other Wi-Fi networks, and distance can weaken or disturb Wi-Fi signals. This is called interference. Modern Wi-Fi routers use multiple antennas. This technology is called MIMO, meaning multiple input, multiple output. It allows the router to transmit different streams of data at the same time, which increases the speed for a single device. There's also beamforming, where the router focuses its signal toward a device instead of spreading it in all directions. This improves range, signal strength, and overall performance.